Where do I begin? It's the year 1979. We started small, but we dreamed big. It was a machine that put labels on medicine containers. Easy enough? Think again. This work requires extreme levels of customization and integration of hardware and software, and automated technology at the time was still quite problematic. Problem solving is more than skill. To quickly and efficiently reach resolution means to know your customer intimately. What do they need? What do they want? What do they need that they don't yet want? We solved our problems and made good machines, but still the years passed one by one and the dream wasn't materializing. Something was amiss. Marketing in those early days was a very foreign concept, especially in Asia. Most companies were simply happy to have a more established company put their logo on their inventions. But we decided not to be most companies. We decided to test this foreign concept in a familiar yet unfamiliar environment. China, land of many, a formidable wall of customs regulations and business practices. It was going to be a long road indeed, with many hills to climb. Marketing is an investment in time and money with an uncertain outcome. Long days of research, establishing networks, expensive advertising, and the most excruciating of all, the waiting, the waiting, the waiting, the waiting. With hard work, persistence, and patience, something is bound to change, and at some point you realize that in fact, the world around you is transforming. It began slow, but the orders came and our little labeling machine was making big inroads into one of the most highly prized markets in the world. Medicine never goes out of style. Modernized societies and aging populations are continuing to drive the pharmaceutical industry with no end. It's a large wave, and if you can establish yourself, you're in for a long ride. Pharma packaging is part of that huge industry. Hundreds of millions of medicine bottles filled every day. And if you can imagine doing this by hand, you can understand the utter necessity of automated technology. You need bottle sorters, counters, measures, fillers, cappers, retorkers, labelers, and quality controllers all done with great meticulous care. And if you don't, the risks can be substantial. America, land of plenty, with unfamiliar customs, regulations, and business practices. Here, medicine is big business and is highly regulated by the US Federal Drug Administration, the law of the land, with even far-reaching global influence. Many foreign government organizations rely on the strict FDA standards to ensure that medicine is properly managed for safe consumer use. At the time, medicine bottling machine manufacturers were mostly splintered. The sorters, counters, measures, fillers, dryers, cappers, labelers. We were all automated, but in discontiguous sections that still required a lot of people to run. Production lines at customer sites continue to be a challenge to administrate and difficult to maintain. When we arrived in America, we did what we do best, research. But we learned something startling. The problems that we fixed so long ago was still occurring throughout the industry today. In that, our confidence in our machines grew and we courageously started on the next part of the dream. What if you could bring these machine vendors into alliance and build an integrated line of machines, reducing manpower and maintenance significantly? It was exciting to think about because we knew there was a need, but how to do? How could a company from afar arrive in a foreign land and congregate the best machines into a single total solution? Branding at the time was a very foreign concept to most companies and they would be happy for another company to put their logo on their inventions. But we were not most companies. In 1997, we purchased CVC Technologies of the USA, a small outfit with business experience in our industry. Our mandate was clear, 
work with our new CVC subsidiary and from ground zero establish an alliance of machine vendors to build an automated integrated line, a total solution product around the American CVC brand. Our first major recruit was a Holland-based company with a well-known, well-made tablet capsule counting system. We hoped it would help us recruit others, and one by one they came, cappers and retorkers, unscramblers and sorters, line quality controllers, either by acquisition or partnership. But now, the real work was about to begin. Integration is truly an exercise in advanced problem solving. Disparate machines with hardware and software so complex, it's exasperating. But if we could pull it off, it would be a major milestone in our industry. But how? By then, it was simply a matter of habit. Research, solve problems, persist, and be patient. We are the integrators. We are the spoon that stirs the soup. Our specialty lies in how we blend and consolidate with synchronicity, expediency, contingency, and consistency. In 2002, the entire company adopted the CVC namesake, and the circle was finally complete. India the land of many, with unfamiliar customs, regulations, and business practices. But she is also sophisticated, learned, and honorable. She possesses one of the fastest growing troves of highly regarded industry and commerce professionals. Together with a strong labor market, it is fertile land for trade and industry. And wouldn't you know it, one of these industries is the pharmaceuticals. It goes like this, U.S. pharmaceutical companies develop the medicine under the watchful eye of the U.S. FDA. These medicines are manufactured and packaged in India and shipped back to the United States, and for that matter, all over the world. In fact, India has become the hub for international medicine distribution, the pharmacy to the world, as some would say. We recruited a team of accomplished Indian professionals and prepared for our first test bed. Our integrated solution product was logically to be in India under the watchful eye of the U.S. FDA. Again, the stakes were high. U.S. FDA approval procedures require investment in money and time. If you have even one hair out of place, it means you don't sell your machines. It's February 21st, 2003. Our integrated system at our customer site has passed U.S. FDA scrutiny. We are ecstatic. CBC has just launched into a new era. In the coming years, CBC will go on to build a tremendous reputation as a formidable, competitive, global name in our industry. CBC is headquartered in Taichung, Taiwan, where both administration, R&D, and factory resides. Subsidiary companies are in the U.S. and Shanghai, as well as an office in India. CVC believes in the strength of local workers, no matter India, China, or America. Here in Taiwan, CVC Technologies boasts one of the lowest employee turnover rates in the nation. To retain loyal employees for the long run is what all companies should covet. It's essential to culture, teamwork, growth, maintaining proprietary know-how, and ultimately, it's about sustainability. The secret is simple and yet seemingly difficult to attain. It's not about year-end celebrations, monthly activities, and it's not even about bonuses and raises. It's about what happens every day, the quality of work, opportunities to learn, a chance to grow, and experience the exhilaration of achievement. Building mutual trust is imperative at CVC. It breeds a loyalty and work ethic that is difficult to shake. Trust. It's a simple concept, but difficult to attain. CVC is not most companies. Innovation is just a word. It's often mentioned, but difficult to achieve. Innovation is solving problems and improving your customer situation. It means building a highly adaptable technology suitable for customization and staying ahead of ever-changing US FDA requirements. Branding is elusive. It's not what a customer thinks, it's what they feel. When they see your logo, a sense of confidence, satisfaction, and loyalty that goes beyond words. It's built on trust that's accumulated over time through a knowledgeable sales force, competent R&D engineers, immaculate equipment, consistent quality performance, attentive and responsible customer service, courteous and respectful representatives, and progressive, decisive, thoughtful leadership. 
What is branding? It's everything that you do and do exceptionally well. They won't think it, they'll feel it. Branding, research, innovation, and sustainability. These words are not taken lightly. They are the cornerstones of CVC technology. These are now ingrained in our culture and drive our company to better pastures. If you want to be a major global brand, the road is long. There are deserts to cross, mountains to climb, and oceans to sail. It takes great courage to travel far, and when you finally arrive, it is others who seek you out. CVC is a major global brand, and that was a dream all along.